Hello everyone, Oli the Repair Dude is here again. In this tutorial video, I'm going to show you how to bypass iCloud activation lock on iOS 15 and 16 on Checkmate devices up to A11 devices. Please note this bypass is semi untested. That means if you force shut down the device or the device ran out of battery, it will relock and you have to re bypass the device. And also, this bypass tool also gives notifications, FaceTime, and iMessage. As you can see here, I have an iPhone 8, which is the 8 11 device on activation lock screen. The first step is to disable any antivirus protection inventory in order for you to extract the Aldas dev. As you can see, I already extracted the tool. The password for the tool zip file is 1234. I already done the extraction, so I'll be showing you how to disable antivirus protections. Go to Windows Security. Go to Virus and Threat Protection. Click Manage Settings. Make sure this is off before you extract the zip file, which I already done so. As you can see, after extracting the zip file for this Aldas Dev or AXE, you can jailbreak your device using WinWin 2.1. Go to WinWin 2.1. Select Pairing 2.0.0 Beta 7 Slash 8. Please note these tools support both rootless and rootful jailbreaks. For me, I'll be selecting rootless for the video. Click Next. I will get this warning for iOS, I mean i11 devices on iOS 15 and 16. Click OK. Let the tool put the device on recovery mode. If for some instance the device don't put on recovery mode, you can try again. Click next. Click OK. Once the device on recovery mode, you can try putting it on recovery mode. I mean DFU mode by following the steps. Now allow the jailbreak process to begin. This will take some time. Once it's all done, let the device boot to the hello screen again. You can now quit. I'll be showing you this device still on the activation lock screen. Open how does that you can click activate. To bypass iCloud activation lock. Once you register your serial number, you can DM me on Twitter to register your serial number. Once it gets successfully activated, continue to set up the device. And boom, now on home screen. Normal power on and off works on the device. Let me show you. Turn off the device. This will take some time. But please note, if you force shut down the device, you have to re-bypass the device. Turn on the device again. Or if you let the battery run out, you will have to re-bypass the device. Back to the home screen and it works. Notification is working as you can see. Notifications is working on the phone. As you can see, notifications works. Then I'm sure FaceTime should be working, but the FaceTime is still signing in though. And FaceTime works. As you can see, send received to my, my email address. I can show you iMessage works. It works, I can see. iMessage works. 
that's all for the video please like share and comment on my video and please do subscribe to my channel i hope to see you in another tutorial video again soon bye for now